Good morning, boys and girls. Sam Flores here with Flats Fever Fishing. It's currently November 21st, 6.30 a.m. On my way to a new location, a new spot that I'm trying out. Never fished this area before. Went to bed with a plan. We we're going to go out to a totally different area to scout. Woke up and plans changed. What are you going to do? That's life. We just have to get out there and do what we got to do. Um, but that's the beauty, you guys. That's that's what's one of the great things that I love about fishing is that it's never the same. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's never... It's. It should never be the same. You know, I, I've seen a lot of guys, and I, I know a lot of guys personally... That'll go out and target a certain species, whether it's snook or redfish. But if they don't get what they're looking for, you know, they don't go to their normal spots or their their spot is taken or whatever the case may be, that they cannot fish that spot or they, they can't catch that fish, pack up and they go home. They, they throw in the towel. It shouldn't be like that. Uh, I believe fishing is a learning curve. Every time... You should try and learn something new every time you get out there. At least I do. Um, whether it's a new spot, how the fish are moving, the tides. What the fish are hitting on. I mean, sometimes they're kind of like us. You don't want to eat the same thing every day or at the same time. And you just got to work with that. You got to know your surroundings and, and hunt. You got you to find them. But, with that being said, I am almost to this new location. I'm going to be waiting today. Uh, beautiful day. It's it's gorgeous day. A little breezy. So, pardon me if it's a little noisy later on in the video. But, it should be good. We'll, we will see. And you know what? Honestly, don't know. Don't know how it's going to be. Don't know what I'm going to encounter. But, we're going to give it a try. We're going to work at it. See you guys in a bit. Nice snook just slow trolling this gulp on a jig right here in about two feet of water right on the flats. Beautiful. What a pretty girl you are. Pretty. Look at that. Nothing crazy, nothing fancy, just jig, about three inch gulp, that new penny color, gets the job done. Nice, nice snug, right on these pilings right here. Picked it up right off the bottom. Beautiful.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we gave it hell. We uh, worked some potholes, mainly just where the sand and the grass met. It was rough. <laughs> it was rough, to say the least. Uh, as you guys saw, I jumped a few snook, put my hands on one of them. Got a couple trout, decent size, nothing, nothing crazy. Beautiful fish, but I mean that's fishing. Sometimes you go out there and you're killing them. Sometimes you go out there and you you can't pay for a bite. But luckily we got a few to chew, and quite the experience. Lost a couple lures. It was just interesting morning. I mean, interesting, interesting morning to say the least. But we got her done. We're headed home now. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed just a couple hours on the flats. Like I said, it was it was a new area, a new flat that I was fishing. I fished the area before on boat, some of the docks and some of the structure near it, never on foot waiting. So now I know a little bit what to look for next time. Maybe, maybe we'll do a little better, <laughs> but that's all I have for you guys today. Hope you enjoyed it. Also, I know a couple of you guys have been asking, what's with this brush stash? This dirt on my lip. Well, No Shave November is upon us, and my job will not allow us to grow a beard. So, I have this beautiful mustache for the time being. And I might shave it tonight because it's it's honestly jogging me nuts. So, pardon the look, but it won't be here for long. Alrighty? You guys have a good day. Have a blessed day. We love you. God bless.